Good evening, everybody. We're gonna do um, a quick little exhaust um, video here real quick tonight. I haven't really seen any other videos about this yet, so I'm gonna try to contribute. <laughs> uh, this is gonna be in regards to a Dodge 1500, the single cab, uh, the Magnaflow exhaust that's kind of like a mid drop-off exhaust, whatever the actual product name is. I'll make sure to put a link in the description below for the exhaust. Um, there's not too many videos online with it. Um, I didn't film the install. Um, there might be one of those by now on here. Uh, it took me about 45 minutes to do the entire thing, and that was just me taking my sweet time. So it's a really easy install for the exhaust. Um, it drops off pretty much under the passenger door. So about right there is where the exhaust pipe itself sits. Um, but as you saw in the beginning, um, the initial startup isn't too bad. It's not that loud at all. So you don't have to worry about, you know, waking up the neighbors or anything like that. It's loud, but it's not anything crazy. Um, so yeah, uh, it's nighttime right now. So put the windows down and give you some exhaust notes of what you can expect it to sound like when you're in the cab so let's get driving so leaving your neighborhood or anywhere at low speeds under 20 is fairly quiet um like i said you don't have to worry about any crazy loud notes on a cold start i actually haven't driven my truck in like two weeks since i've had the klr so this is definitely a cold start um and as you saw it wasn't that bad so the truck's been running about 10 minutes, so it's warmed up a little bit here. But like I said, this is pretty quiet. That was up to 45. Pretty quiet. It's just a nice little grunt. It's nothing crazy. It's not like a Honda Ricer or anything like that. I've taken it on um, some road trips since I've had it. And on the highway, it does not do any kind of droning or anything. It's actually really nice on the highway. So we got the windows up now, um, cruising at 45. Can't really see anything, I know it's nighttime here. But with the GoPro mic, going about 48. It's fairly quiet in the cab. I mean, obviously it sounds like you're in a truck and I have the, um, the off-road mud tires on my truck, so it's not the quietest ride with the windows up regardless of what exhaust I have but yeah it's not bad at all pretty tame you can still listen to low volume music talk to your passenger it's nice now as far as the model truck I am in um, this is my 2018 Ram 1500 uh, 3.6 liter uh, the trim model, I believe, is the Tradesman, uh, so that would, I believe, be the Penstar engine. Um, I've had this since it had about 18,000 miles on it, and I'm at 103,000 right now, and I've had it since 2021, so I like the drive. <laughs> Road trips are fun. This thing's been a champ. I have had zero issues with it, no leaks, nothing. Um, the only thing I've done is new tires and changed the oil a couple times. <laughs> That's about it. I mean, this thing is, everyone's always like, oh, you got a Dodge Ram. <coughs> Better spread them wallet cheeks. It's going to drain your bank account's balls. Yeah, I haven't had any issues with this thing. So, all reliable. Dodge and uh, I think Dodge has been pretty good to me. 
can't say the same for some of you guys, but I love this old girl. Yeah, it's very calm. It's nothing crazy in the cab. It's just a nice exhaust with a little bit of girth to it. <laughs> not gonna impress any ladies or cause a crowd but definitely sounds better than the stock exhaust the other thing I need to make a video on at some point um, is a review of these nylight uh, LED lights um, they're on Amazon I think they're sold other places too but the brand is called nylight but I have the two small spotlights um, with the underhood attachment. And then I have, I think it's a 20 inch, maybe not that big. Maybe it's a 14 inch. I have the LED bar on the front bumper. Um, but they work really good for how much they are. So that'll be a video eventually. <laughs> All right, so we're just gonna go down. Um, road here where the speed limit's 55 show you the non-existent droning <laughs> it's very quiet at 45 I have the AC uh, set to I guess the second setting so have that set the fan speed to really quiet most of the sound you're gonna hear um, is mainly the off-road tires. The tires are at sometimes the same volume, if not louder, than the exhaust. Um, I do have a cold air K&N intake, but honestly, that doesn't do much for the sound. I mean, you can barely, it doesn't make anything noticeable, really the exhaust is louder than the cold air intake sometimes I forget I even have the damn thing sometimes it sounds like the stock intake so it's not a huge mod to do to these trucks if you're thinking about doing you know the cold air intake I mean it's you can it's a little bit louder but it's nothing you know to write home about it's a mod you can definitely live without doing one thing I'm still getting used to in this part of town now that I live over here is um, there's a huge medical marijuana farm uh, to my right. And my God, <laughs> even with the AC set to inside air and the windows up, I'm still pretty far from it too. Maybe a little under a mile from the damn place. And like, you can get a goddamn contact high driving through here at night. <sighs> looking for a really loud exhaust for these trucks I mean this is not the one very quiet um, very manageable if you're looking for something safer you know your neighborhood and out of courtesy for your neighbors and you just don't want something very loud that drones or any of the reasons um, I would definitely recommend this one it's a nice little tone to it nothing too crazy the price point is definitely a turnoff. Um, I only purchased it because <laughs> I had a lot of extra money at the time. So I was like, all right, 700 whatever dollars, let's do it. So I'm sure a lot of people would rather go, you know, to an exhaust shop. You could probably get a full system, honestly, for less than that. But I was just looking for something that I could just install at the house super easy plus I kind of like the look of it that mid drop off style and at the time um, price was not an object so 
I'm happy with it. Um, yeah, any questions, you want to see more videos on this, just leave it in the comment below. Um, I have all the camera gear in the truck, the exhaust, I can make videos whenever. So, <laughs> so anything you want to know about it, uh, any other areas you would like to hear it in, uh, let me know. Uh, if you watched the whole video, thank you as always, and I'll see you on the next one.